my YouTube channel, The Modest Middle-Aged Mom. Today I have a new Shein order that I thought we would look through. I just got it a few days ago. I opened the packaging, but I have not pulled anything out. So as I pull these things out, I will tell you the size and how much I pay for each item. Then we'll do a try on to see if you guys like them. I'm a plus size mom. I'm always looking for something modest to wear that is cute and a little stylish and make me not look as old as I actually am. But let's get started with this haul and I'll start pulling it, everything out. Here we go. The first item looks like it's plus ditzy floral puff sleeve blouse and I got a 0XL and this was $10.92. That's really cute. It's got a little puff sleeve, elastic. That's really pretty. It's kind of a pink but it's a ditzy floral. So that's really cute. We'll give that a try. Might be a little snug on the top area here, but we'll try it out and see how it looks. The next item <laughs> is a hat. <laughs> I'm not really sure what that's gonna look like in the corner. This is it's called a simple fedora hat. And this was, with the discount, I got, it was $3.65. I don't know what this is gonna look like. I don't know, let's see what's gonna happen with this. think it's squished it's so squished around through here I just thought it was cute for three dollars and something so we'll see what happens to this I'll let it sit out a little while and see if this kind of relaxes out a little bit I'm not really sure what's gonna happen with that I think you can tighten it maybe with that I don't need it tighter but why did they squish it like that it's really cute, but it is squished. I don't know. I don't know. We'll have to see about that. So anyway, it was, only, it was less than $4. I can always send it back, so we'll see. <laughs> we'll see if I send anything else back. On to the next item. This is a t-shirt plus rainbow and slogan graphic tee. This was $10.01. That's really cute. That's very on trend right now with the rainbows. It says be kind. So that's really, oh, but look, do you see the problem with that? Is it off center? I don't know, we'll see. Maybe not when I get it on. Looks like it's off center a little. I don't know, maybe not. We'll see when I get it on what that looks like. But this is a zero XL. I feel like I should have gone up a size on that. The colors of that, it's really, that's really pretty. Shein sizes are really strange. Sometimes I'll get something and it'll be big and sometimes I get it and it's too little. Sometimes I, you know, I get it and it's just right. And I try to look at the measurements because if you click on the different sizes, it gives you the, the measurements. And I try to go by my measurements, but it's not 100% accurate every time. So keep that in mind if you do any orders with Shein that it's kind of a hit or miss on the sizing sometimes for me. The last order I placed, I tried to go up a size and some stuff, it was really big. So I had to return it, but you just never know. So just keep that in mind. You can always order it again in the correct size, but just keep that in mind that the sizing is a little off sometimes. Here's the next item. This, I think, is a dress. It says, Shein plus shawl color flounce sleeve pleated hem buckle belted leopard dress. That's a mouthful. In a 1X. This was $23.60. I dropped the belt. Where's the belt? This looks like it'll fit, but honestly, it's kind of 
kind of looks like a grandma dress a little bit to me. <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. It looks like it will fit, but we'll see how this is. There's the belt, just a little thin belt. The print is really pretty, but I don't know. We'll see when we get on it. Kind of looks like a grandma dress to me. I don't know. We'll see. Okay, the next item is another. This is a skirt. It says plus leopard print flare skirt in a 1X. And this was. Six dollars and eighty-two cents. That's a pretty print. That's a really pretty print. It's very long. I'll need to hem it if I decide to keep it. But that's a really pretty print. Okay, we'll try that on and see what that looks like. Let's see. This looks like a top, maybe. Plus ditzy floral, floral. Plus ditzy floral sheared ruffled trim blouse. Oh, that is precious. Oh, I hope that fits. That is really, really cute. It's got the smocking gathering and a little ruffle here at the top with an elastic sleeve. And it's kind of got a gray background with off-white, brown, and a little black. That's really pretty. I hope that fits. That's, I really, really like that. Okay, and this is the last thing. This is a set. It's a skirt and a top. It says plus letter and figure graphic tee and leopard pleated skirt and an XL. This is $20.93. And so, here's the shirt. <laughs> Messy bun. Did it say anything? Home life, the messy bun, and then the skirt. Oh, that looks a little small. Well, no, not when you stretch it out. Yeah, one X. <laughs> With that. So that's really cute. It's super long. I'll have to probably pull it up high because I don't know how I would hem this with these pleats and make it look right. So we'll see. I might. I don't really know about that. So we'll see. So let's give these a try on and see what we think and decide what we're going to keep and what we're going to return. So I'll be right back with the first outfit. Okay, this is the first little top. I kept it on with the skirt I had on. And I have these little, I guess, dusty pink little flat shoes I got from Loft. I wear a lot of flat shoes because I have a little bit of a knee issue. But it's close to the same color as the pink in this. And this is a plus ditzy floral puff sleeve blouse. Originally $12. And it was on sale for $10.92. I think this is really cute with puff sleeve. There's plenty of room in the arms with the elastic. And I brought out one of my trusty vests that I got on Amazon. And I thought this looked cute with it. Let me turn around first so you guys can see what this looks like all the way around. This is a zero X. I think this is cute, right? A zero X. Yeah, zero X. And this pink is almost the same. It's in the same pink family as my shoes and the shirt. I always want to throw a vest on something to cover up a little bit. I think this looks cute with it as well. I think this is a keeper. I think it would be pretty with a khaki, like a khaki skirt. But I think this is good for the modest length. The arm length is good, pretty good. And the neck is definitely good. And it's not see-through. But this is cute. I think I'll keep this for $10.92. So, on to the next. This outfit is completely nothing like me at all. This hat, y'all, this hat is bad. I think it looks okay on me, but it's just completely squished. I don't know why they didn't pack it better, but it is completely squished. I don't know how it would survive that shipping and that packaging. It's got this little trim on it that fell off that I put back on, but I don't know. But this shirt is super cute, but it's 
it's crooked. That's not just in my head, is it? It looks like it's off center, like it's over here too far. I would probably keep this, but it is like over here. It needs to come over a little bit. And I think it's so cute with these little shoes that I hauled in my Walmart haul, one from last week. These are Golden Goose, I think is the name. Good dupes. They're uber expensive, but they're kind of like this. But I think this looks really cute together, except for this squished hat and this off center. I don't think that's in my mind, is it? It looks like it's this way too far. But I do think the little outfit is cute, other than the hat being squished and this being off center. So I'm a little sad because I do think this is kind of cute and kind of trendy. But just be aware, this is, and it is also a little thin. I don't know if you guys can tell that. It's a little bit thin. I'm a little sad about this. I thought, I, I know this is kind of a trendy little thing here. And I was really hoping that this little outfit with these shoes would work, but it's just off center. I can't deal with that. So anyway, so the hat, I'll tell you, I'll go back and tell you, the hat with a discount was only $3.65. I don't know. I wanted to straighten out. And the t-shirt was $10 and one penny. So this really, for $10, this should be right. I mean, this should be right. And then this is my skirt and then my little Walmart Golden Goose dupes. These are really, really cute. I really like these. So just know that you might want to check out Walmart for these. I think they were like $24, less than $25. Um, but these are cute. I haven't worn them out yet, but just wearing them in the house, they're super comfortable. So anyway, on to the next outfit. A little sad about this to care. I brought the hat back. Y'all, this is so cute. Now, I will tell you, I don't know, can you see how long it is? I still have them, have my little tennis shoes on them that I got from Walmart. They're the Golden Goose dupes. They look so cute with this, but I have this pulled way, way up because it's so long and it's sweeping the floor. But this is so cute. I love this. I might just live with this sweeping the floor because I think this is so cute. It says mom life on it with a messy bun. I would probably, couldn't help them do the hat. I would probably do the messy bun myself if I wore this. And I do have a leopard print little, little scrunchie that I could put up here with it. But this is so cute. It would be really cute if you're tall because you can just see how long this is. I guess I can pull it up some more. But this is cute. I love this. As much as I thought I would. This was the set. It was a set for $20.93. I may actually wear that tomorrow. That is so cute with my tennis shoes. I love this. So this is a keep for sure. <laughs> Not the hat. What do you guys think of this? a nice church dress. I'm going to take these shoes off so I'm not playing around. Um, this Shein plus shawl collar flounce sleeve pleated hem buckle belted leopard dress. This was $23.60. So let me take these shoes off. Uh, this dress is pretty. It would need to be pinned right here. I haven't pinned it because it will just flounce open I think uh, or something worn under it right there. I would definitely put a safety pin right there to keep it closed but it fits nicely. I think it fits really nicely. I do kind of feel like it's a grandma dress. Maybe, I don't know, it feels grandma-y. I don't know. I do think it would be really pretty for my office whenever I'm back in the office and he's ironing. But what do you guys think? This was a 1XL and then 14 is in brackets, but I think it's a little bit bigger than a 14, honestly, because I normally wear a 16, 18-ish in that range. And this was $23.60. Do y'all think it looks like a grandma dress? The fabric is just polyester. There's no stretch to it. The pleats look like they're doing a little funny. And the, the waist is up under here, not on my actual waist. So I think that makes it a little more flattering, but I don't know. Feels a little grandma-y. I don't know. I mean, I know I'm not young, but I also don't want to be, if I'm old enough to be a grandma. I don't know. 
feels like it's my gray headed grandma a little bit. I don't know. I do think it would be really nice for my office. It's a bank. It's a little more buttoned up, dressy sometimes when we have visitors, people from our main office. So I think this would be nice for that, but honestly, oh, grandma, I don't know. I'm gonna have to think on this one. So let's move on to the next one. Okay, y'all, this is the skirt. This is a top I already had from Bob Fran Taylor, my usual place. This is a skirt plus leopard print flare skirt and a 1X that was $6.82. I don't really love this. I would have to hem it, as you can see, I think. It is hitting almost the floor, definitely the tops of my feet. Elastic waist. I don't know, it's a little grandma too. I, don't, I didn't mean to buy grandma clothes, but I don't really think there's anything special about this skirt. I think it would be pretty with red. But I just put on my little pink flats that I had on with that other outfit. But I don't know. It's nothing. It's white background with gray and black. It would be pretty with red, too. But I don't know. I think it's not very flattering. Maybe if I had a different shirt on. I don't know. Maybe something made a little different. I don't know. This one I just don't love. So I think I'm going to send this one back. So we'll see. I think I have another top to try on, I think. I don't know. But we'll see what I decide on this one. So. What y'all think of this blouse? Skirt's mine, shoes are mine, not from the shoe What do you think of this blouse? Are the little wings too much? I actually think this is really pretty. It fits very nicely. This was called Plus Ditsy Floral Sheared ruffled trim blouse for $6.38. This is really pretty. I think the quality of this is nice. This is stretchy. This is not. The sleeves are stretchy. I think if it's really nice, this is a zero XL, but this is pretty. I'm gonna come closer. I don't know if I showed you this material, but it's like a gray with a taupey pink, brown, a little black and cream, but this is a really pretty. I like this. A lot so for six dollars and I said 38 cents I'll keep this so or unless I look back at this and these little wings are much I feel like I'm flying away a little <laughs> but these are cute so I think I may keep this what you think I hope you guys enjoyed my Shein try on and maybe there were some items that you would like to purchase I realized when I sat down to edit this video that I did not do a conclusion to let you know the items I decided to keep. So here I am with what I decided to keep from all of those items. There was only a few things, but maybe you'll find something in all of the items I picked that would suit you. Me being short, I know I say that all the time, it kind of limits what I can do and just it and wide. Short and wide is not always a great combination. So I have to try it on to see if I like it. But here's a few things that I did decide to keep. I've already worn one of these things and I really, really loved it. It's this blouse that has the smock detail at the top with the stretchy and it has the little detail with the little ruffle on the sleeve. I really love this. I thought it fit well. I wore it with a brown skirt, is that right? I believe I wore it with a brown skirt and a cream little vest like this one I have on and I really thought that was cute and I thought it looked kind of dressy and kind of we went to Chili's in it and I felt kind of cute so anyway this was really something I liked and I only paid six dollars and 38 cents for this little blouse so and I'll bring it up closer so you can see it all again I thought that print was really pretty for fall and I think I wore it with my little pink little flats that I got from the loft so I thought that was cute and then I decided I would keep this leopard skirt I am going to have to have the hem have it hemmed because it is sweeping the floor and I think I would just be more comfortable and I'm probably gonna have it taken up from here since it's got these pleats in it i don't want to mess up the pleats at the bottom 
So it's this skirt with this shirt that says mom life. I think when I did the video, I said home life, but that says mom life on it. And that's so cute with the messy bun. I haven't worn it yet. I know I said I was going to, but I decided after I filmed the video that I really do think I want to get it hemmed. I think it'll be a lot more comfortable and take some bulk out of right here around my belly here. But I think this is super cute. I think it would be really cute with an oversized black sweater, maybe just kind of, uh, do they call it a boyfriend sweater? That's kind of big. I think that would be really cute with that. And I wanted to show you these shoes that I've talked about. My videos, I, I need to work on my videos and get my camera angles right. So I apologize for that. I had these shoes on in several videos and you couldn't really see them. These are from my Walmart haul and I told you about them and I put it on with this little outfit. I thought it was so cute with that. These are from Walmart and I believe they were like $24.97, $24.94 or something like that. They're like around $25. But I think these are like a, a dupe for Golden Goose. I did not know about those kind of shoes until I heard one of my YouTube ladies that I like to watch, she was talking about them and I went to check them out and they are so expensive. And I just don't really think I would ever pay hundreds and hundreds of dollars for sneakers, but sneakers that I just don't wear that much. That's more of a trendy item to me. These are definitely trendy looking. I just, I'm not going to pay that much money for that. But anyway, so I'm, I apologize for my videos not showing these and I wanted to show you these because I wore them with several outfits in my Walmart haul and in my Shein haul. So I do apologize for my bad video angle. I'm trying to get better. So hopefully pray for me that I will. So, but these are super cute. And there's one other item that I tried to return that it would not let me return. And I don't really know why, maybe because it was only $3 and 65 cents. But I will tell you that I'm filming this little conclusion video about a week and a half after I actually did the try on and it looks a lot better than it did when it arrived. My hat. So I guess this one will be staying at least until I send it to Goodwill. But anyway, I thought you might get a little kick out of this little hat that I kind of had fun with. But if you will notice a week and a half with it sitting out, the wrinkles have just about come out of it. So maybe I'm glad I didn't send it back. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this Shein haul. I will try to do my videos better where you can see my shoes, my full outfit, and get a full view of what I'm wearing. And maybe you'll like to order some of the things I've tried on and you maybe like the outfit combinations I made and you can kind of work something out with something you already have in your wardrobe. But anyway, I'm glad you joined me for my Shein haul and I, join me again. I think I have a Kohl's and a JCPenney order. I think I may combine those into one video because I don't think there was that much in my Kohl's order. So I may do a combo video with both of those. We'll have to see when I start filming how that is. But I hope you come back and see me in my next video. And remember, today is a good day to make it a good day. Even when you have on a hat you thought you were gonna return. Bye, see you next time.